The office of Kevin McCarthy is firing back tonight against the Los Angeles Times investigation into his in-laws construction business. Now, here's the story. Sunday, the Times published a report on Vortex Construction, which is owned by William Wages, Congressman McCarthy's brother-in-law. The Times says Bill Wages claimed to be one-eighth Cherokee, making his minority-owned company eligible for federal contracts through the Small Business Administration. The Times reports that Vortex received more than $7 million in federal contracts through the SBA from 2000 to 2007. Much of the work involved China Lake Naval Air Weapons Station in Ridgecrest, which is in McCarthy's 23rd Congressional District. The Times investigation could not verify Wage's Native American heritage claim because Cherokee tribal leaders say the tribe Wage's laid claim to is not considered legitimate. The Times reports its investigation found no evidence that McCarthy, McCarthy did anything to steer contracts to his brother-in-law's company. But ethics watchdogs interviewed by the Times questioned whether the success of Bill Wage's business in McCarthy's own district was a coincidence. In a statement, Congressman McCarthy's spokesperson Matt Sparks slammed the article as a non-story. Bill Wages issued a statement to 17 News today, which reads in part, after months of Freedom of Information Act requests by the LA Times staff, a story was written for the sole purpose of impugning me, my family, and my small business. It became clear to me they had their own story to write. The Times hit piece is a sad example of journalism and what it's become but also deeply concerning for how political motivation and false allegations can often permanently scar a private business person's good name." End quote. 